All right, this is a demonstration on how to buy the Wakanda Inu token or any other token, right? Uh, I'm going to try to make this as quick as possible. So I'm going to be talking a little bit faster than usual. So you can either pause or rewind and watch it over if you need to. So first thing you need to do is download the Trust Wallet, right? For, in my case, I already have Trust Wallet installed. So I'm just going to open it, right? So the first thing that you need to do is get some money in here in the form of BNB, right? Which is the Binance token right as you can see on the fourth on the third line one two three the third one bnb that's not what we need we need the smart chain bnb right in order for us to get the smart chain bnb you're going to click the gear icon on the top right corner and type in smart chain and you're going to click the toggle to turn it on right so you do that and you click done right so now we have smart chain in here so you're going to click on smart chain and click receive right so copy this address right and take it to binance or wherever you you are going to buy your bnb from right so you're going to send you're going to send in bnb to this address right so you copy it and take it to binance send some bnb into this address that you just copied right so you click done once you once you once you, once you receive your bnb right then you can go to a browser right once you go to the browser and you type in pancakeswap.finance right pancakeswap.finance as you can see at the bottom here right so then you click trade now right once you click trade now at the top right corner click con uh, connect wallet right you click on connect wallet you choose trust wallet you click trust again and click open right so now you have to click connect to for you to be able to sign your transactions, right? Click connect. Now go back to the browser. So as you can see, now the your trust wallet is connected to PancakeSwap, right? So now you can see your balance of BNB. Now you need to select the coin that you want to buy. So you click the bottom one, bottom one and click um select the token so now you're going to copy the wakanda tokens contract address which i'm going to send to you or the person that sent you this video is going to send you the contract address for wakanda right so um i'm going to copy the wakanda inus contract address which is right here you click copy and take it to the web browser right you paste it in here And that's the Wakanda Inu token. You click on it. Yeah. Okay. For my in in my case, I already I already did it, so it didn't prompt me for an error message. But in your case, it most likely is going to prompt you saying, "Do you want to do this?" You're going to click yes. You understand, and you click okay. Right. So once you do that, you're going to type in the amount of BNB that you want to buy. So for this demonstration, I'm just going to type in something really small, like 0 0.01. So once I do that, it's going to um, give me an estimate of how much Wakanda token that I'm going to get back. You click on swap. You click. Um, OK, you click on swap. You click on confirm swap. Right. Once you do that, it's going to ask you to open your trust wallet. You're going to open your trust wallet, right? And it's going to ask you to sign it. You click confirm, right? So once you do that, you go back to your um, web browser. Now it's trying to confirm. So I'm not going to wait for it to confirm. But um, once it's finished, right, it's going to tell you that it's done. You click OK. And you go back to your trust wallets, right? uh once you do that you wouldn't be able to see your token that you just bought right so in order for you to see the token that you just bought with the wakanda token you're going to click the gear icon on the top right corner again right and you're going to scroll all the way down right and you're going to click add custom token right on the network side you're going to choose smart chain change it to smart chain right and you're going to paste the contract address of Wakanda token again, right? You click on, I already copied it. So you click on paste, right? And it's going to automatically populate the name, the symbol and the decimal, right? Click save, right? Once you do that, you're going to see the, um, the amount of token that you just bought, right? As you can see, that's the Wakanda token.